Hello everyone and welcome to Aviation A to Z present verses. Today's topic is really interesting as many students have already asked that what and which field we choose. Should we go for mechanical or avionics? So in this video we will be looking at them and I will let you judge which is best for you. So let's get started. First of all we will see what is mechanical and avionics and later we will compare them and read them accordingly. So watch this video till end and if you are new to our channel subscribe it and click on bell icon to never miss our video. Let us start with mechanical stream and what skills you need to choose it. In our aircraft maintenance engineering course the definition of mechanical is something which includes working on undercarriage, airframe structure, on power plant and hydraulic and pneumatic system and in short physical work or exterior work is more. In this you not only need your mind but must be physically fit to perform heavy tasks like standing for 3 to 4 hours working in extreme conditions such as heat, cold and rain as well as able to find and rectify fault as soon as possible. So overall this field requires more physical and little psychological strength. Now let's see what skills you need to choose mechanical field. Remember our AME field is very underrated and many people don't even know that we exist. Without us aircraft cannot fly. So first skill is responsibility. You must be responsible for whatever task you perform. And next ability is to work under extreme pressure. Talking about line maintenance or transit, you need to be very quick as flight is scheduled to depart on time. If you are not able to work under pressure, then you cannot work efficiently and which can lead to incident and accident. So if you are calm and has ability to handle the pressure, then this is your field. Moving forward, we need to have commercial awareness, which means we must save the money of airlines this quality is applicable for Avenix as well. Last but most important skill is proper verbal and written communication skill, which means you must be able to talk clearly and loudly. As at workplace there can be much noise and destruction, you must be able to write properly and also able to read manuals. To summarize what we learned for mechanical steam is he she must be stronger, able to work under pressure psychologically good as well as calm and able to communicate properly. Now let us see what is Avenix stream and what skills you need to choose it. It's always fascinating to see the control room of aircraft that is cockpit and it's really complicated and modular. But as we are advancing the aircraft are becoming more and more maintenance friendly and manufacturers is developing its Avenix technology. So the Avenix stream has lots of scope. But before we talk about scope and job, let us see its definition. Avenix stream in AMA field means a person is able to work on electrical, electronics and radio navigational equipment and able to troubleshoot, rectify and make such system operate you. So, if you are interested in working inside cockpit, cabin, interior and little exterior, for you this is perfect stream. As I mentioned earlier, mechanical person needs more physical strength, so as Avenix need much more psychological strength, as they need to perform tasks on complicated wire bundles which run all across the aircraft and their jobs are really crucial as it's really difficult to work under very compact space and maintain all Avenix system operative. Skills to become Avenix AME is little similar to mechanical but yet varies and are as follows. Precision skill in their hand like a surgeon as well as they must be able to work in compact areas and where it's difficult to see equipment work on basis of experience. So it's truly skillful job. At last to summarize, what you need to choose this stream is psychological strength, skillful hand and able to work in any place.
Now let us compare them and this comparison is just according to their work and remember both has its own advantages. Talking about jobs for both field as per standard situation it's 2 is to 1 ratio. Per aircraft you need 2 mechanical person and 1 avionics person. So yes there is more demand for mechanical person as compared to avionics. As there are more mechanical seats so more students are passing and avionics has limited seats. So 2 is to 1 ratio here as well. So both got equivalent demand and supply. Talking about future, there will be upgrade in avionics system but no one can replace mechanical person so both field has good future. If circumstances was normal like if there was no shutdown of jet airways and covid-19 crisis our aviation industry was creating jobs and flourishing. But due to this pandemic this sector got hit really bad and it's really difficult to get job in few months. I know it's bitter truth but it's truth. I hope you got clear idea about both field and its skill. If any doubt leave in comment section and finally subscribe and share this video to your friends and colleagues. Thanks for watching stay safe.